Today in Minecraft, President Crafton needs our help to defeat a Gorgon, but things take a hilarious turn of events when Melon gets transformed into stone. Ah, help, I can't move. Like the video in the next two seconds to turn me back. Well, Melon was busy being a rock. I got the Gorgon's head, and now I can turn anything I want into stone. But things take a turn for the worse when Sunny starts abusing this power, and now he's turned everything into stone. Help! And if you don't want to be turned into stone, subscribe to our channel right now. Ugh, oh, what is that sound? Who's here at this hour? What is going on? Let's go! Destroy those toilets! Come on! I need a bigger tower. I need an upgraded Titan cameraman. Let's go! Let's go! Sunny, what are you doing right now? Oh, I was playing toilet tower defense. Bro, are you kidding me? Oh, dude, there's been knocking at the door for like the last five minutes. Dang it, bro. You're so annoying sometimes. I didn't hear anything. I was in the zone. Ugh, oh, who's there? Uh, hello? President Crafton, what are you doing here? Uh, Melon? This doesn't look good. Boys, we have bad news. A Gorgon has threatened to expand into our lands. We need you to take her down. Do that and we will pardon all of your past activities. And you have done a lot of bad things. A lot. We, we haven't even done anything. Oh, really? Yeah, and you know what I have for sunshine? This guy! Oh, yeah, Melon. <laughs> I guess we have caused a few problems here and there. Well, Sonny, I guess it's time to pay off our debts. Let's gear up and slay this Gorgon. Let's do it! Gear, gear, gear. Actually, wait. President Crafton, do you have some really powerful gear we could borrow? You're on your own. Good luck. Dang it! Melon, we're on our own. It's all all good, Sonny, because I hopefully have gear somewhere. I've got some iron. Uh, I know I put it somewhere. Hey! Oh, I'm gonna make the best armor ever. Let's go. I'm gonna take some of these diamonds, make myself a diamond sword. Check me out, Melon. I'm geared up and ready for battle. Bro, you're really wearing gold armor, dude? That thing is gonna break in no time. Yeah, but I'll look fashionable while I battle. Whatever you say, bro. You can look fashionable. I'll do all the actual work. And I'll even make us some golden apples. Here you go. Melon, the apples are right behind you. Thank you, Sonny. There are the sticks. Looking for those. And let's do this thing, Sonny. Uh, I don't have a weapon right now, Melon. Hold on. Give me a second. Oh, my goodness. I'll craft you a diamond sword. No, no. I got something right here. I got something right here. I will kill this Gorgon with eggs. You know what? Good luck. Good luck using the eggs. You are absolutely useless, dude. Let's slay this Gorgon. I'm with you. Soon they'll be Gorg off. Get it? Ah, uh, I get it. I get it. Melon, it looks like we made it. The Gorgon's Temple. Sonny, I, uh, I'm kind of getting a little scared. Do you think she's strong? Not only is she strong, Melon, she's got magical energy. She can turn you into stone. Don't look her in the eyes. Okay, but Sonny, she's not even here. Dude, everyone knows she's gonna be in the basement. Oh, there's levers, and we need to pull these to activate something. Exactly. Something's moving when I flick this one. Sonny, I think it works. It revealed a staircase. Secret passage. Go, Melon. Go. Uh, I don't like this, Sonny. Why are there statues everywhere? Ah! These are the fallen heroes who once tried to slay the Gorgon. Dang it, Melon. You looked her in the eyes, you idiot. Uh, I'll have to handle this myself. Where's his diamond sword? Did I pick it up? Yeah, there we go. And then I kill her with eggs. Die. Oh, no. I can't look at her. Slice. Slice. Dice. And then everything nice. Oh, wait, this is really easy. Melon, all you needed was golden armor. Light work. One Gorgon beheaded. I have sliced and diced, and now I'm the one who's got that nice. Look at that. Look at that Gorgon. Look at it. Well, I guess now that I've killed the Gorgon and saved Minecraft, might as well save Melon too. Hey, welcome back. Oh, what? Where's the Gorgon, Sonny? Where is she? She's dead. I took care of it. You were making fun of my golden armor, but it protected me from her vision. Or maybe it was my sunglasses. I'm s so confused. Sonny, one second she was here, and then the next second she was gone, and then you were over there. I, I don't understand. What happened? Also, do you want your armor back? You kind of exploded and got turned into stone just a little bit. The heck? Oh, thank goodness I'm not dead though. You're welcome. Can I have my sword back? Yeah, sure. I also think I want to set this creeper free. Chill. Chill. Chill! Yeah, you're right. I'll leave him there. Well done, boys. Thanks for killing the Gorgon. Did you take her head by any chance? What head? The Gorgon's head. 
has lots of eyeballs around it like snakes, and it turns things into stone. Uh, yeah, no head here. No head here. Yeah, I was turned into stone the whole time. Oh, thank goodness that's over with. And after a hard days of work, all I want to do is sit back, lay back, and eat some cake. Yo, me too. That sounds delicious. Here you go. Uh, thank you, Sonny, for my diamonds back. And now, I'm gonna get us some cake. Hey, guys, that was so close. I accidentally hovered on the Gorgon's head. What if Melon realized I had this? I lied to the president so I could use this head to <laughs> prank Melon. Do 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 do. Hello, Alex. I will take uh, one cake, please, for one diamond. Hey, let's go. I'm gonna be eating good tonight. Cake is gonna be delicious. Let's just set this on the table for later. I wonder if Sonny wants some of this cake. Yo, Sonny, Sonny, you want any cake? Let's go, guys. We got to arrest Barry. He can't put us in prison forever. It's time to break out of this obby. Oh, what was that, Melon? I, I said, do you want any cake? Oh, yeah, that sounds delicious, bro. Why don't you just give me like two minutes? Maybe you take your armor off and relax, bro. You could even play some Barry's prison run if you want. Oh, I could play some Barry's? Let's go. I love me some Barry's. Yo, guys. <laughs> While Melon's playing some video games upstairs, I'm going to use my Gorgon head to just really quickly turn that cake into stone. Yes. <laughs> and you know what? Just to make sure he has no other food, let's change this refrigerator, shall we? Perfect. <laughs> Prank number one. Now I'll just wait for Melon to come downstairs. Now that I've stored my armor, let's tell Melon it's time to eat. Yo, bro, you ready to have some cake? Am I, dude? I'm starving. I can't wait to feast. Bro, you are still wearing that sweaty armor. Fine, bro. Take it off. But now I'm chowing down. Where's the cake? Wait, dude, you had a cake in the kitchen? This whole time it's just been a stone slab. What the heck? What is happening? What is happening? No, 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 no. Where's the cake? Maybe I put it in the- The fridge is stone as well. What the heck? What is wrong with you, Melon? Why are you redecorating our house like this? No, this wasn't me, Sonny. What is going on? No, no, no. I'm so hungry. Three hours later. Dang it, bro. I'm gonna have to buy a whole other cake and devour it. Ah, oh, Steve, what do you want? Now's not the time. I'm trying to eat. Um, dude, where are you? You're up on set in 10 minutes for your stand-up routine. That was today? Dang it! Uh, sorry guys, uh, for being late. Um, anyways, let me get into this routine. Uh, okay, um, what should I do here, guys? I completely forgot to write a script. Uh, ooh, I know just the person to pick on. Hey, everybody, why did Sonny go to school? Hey, wait, what? To get brighter, of course. <laughs> okay, 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 guys, 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 I got another one. What did the sun say to the naughty cloud? You're not raining on my parade. Bro, that was lame. Whatever, whatever. That wasn't my best work. But why did Sonny apply for a job? For a brighter future. <laughs> alright, alright. I got another one. What did the sun say to the fridge? I'm just here to warm things up a bit. Yeah, that is what I said to the fridge today. <laughs> what? Oh, nothing. Nothing. Anyways, Melon, get off stage. Everyone's sick of you. Time for my comedy. Okay. Mm, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my comedy show. Tonight's gonna be a great one. We have special guest melon who i will totally not be bullying now let's begin why did the watermelon bring a ladder to the grocery store huh anyone anyone quandale quandale oh to reach the watermelons and to stick them into a blender oh quandale that's pretty close and <laughs> that's a great one but no actually it was because he wanted to climb the watermelon wait i wrote that i wrote that that was terrible so, excuse me sorry everybody looks like my ghost writer's a little off today how about this one how about this one what did the melon say to the cucumber at the salad party you're looking cool but i'm one in a melon boo boo all right, one more try, one more try. How did the melon propose to its love? He gave her a melon dramatic letter. No? Yo, Sonny, just, just get off stage, Sonny. You're trash. No, no, I got one more. I got one more. I'm gonna need a volunteer from the crowd, though. Anyone? Uh, melon, why don't you come on stage? Oh my goodness, Sonny, dude, you're just embarrassing yourself. <clears throat> so, why did the melon statue stay so still? Bro, I don't, I don't even know where this is going. It's gonna be terrible. Hey, melon, over here. Huh? <laughs> 
knew you'd like that one, ladies and gentlemen. It's a classic. And the best part is, he won't remember a thing. He'll just be wondering why his items are scattered. Melon. Oh, Melon. Um, what, what just happened? Oh, thank you for volunteering. You were a great part of the act. Everybody loved it. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. What? Why? Why are my items all over the floor? I don't understand. <laughs> sorry, Melon. A magician never reveals his secrets. <clears throat> I'm sorry, Melon. A real magician never reveals his secrets. Okay, this is really weird. Oh, Melanie, your eyes are so beautiful. They complement your hair so well. And I love the outfit you chose for today. Melon. I've never worn anything else. Yeah, that's true. Guys, Melon was supposed to play video games with me today. But look at him. He's out on a date with Melanie. That's it. Why I ought to give him a prank call so I can trick him into leaving. That way I can turn his precious Melanie into stone. Hello, is this Melon? Uh, yes, this is Melon. Congratulations, this is Chechu Betcho with the town lottery, and you've won 10,000 diamonds. No way. I've won 10,000 diamonds? Head down to Quandale's laboratory to collect your prize. Melanie, I'll be right back. I'm rich. Guys, it actually worked. Look at him. He's off to Quandale's. Now, let me just sneak into this little cafe and pay Melanie a visit. <laughs> hey, Melanie. You think you can just distract my brother and take Take him away from the video games! I was trying to have a good day playing Barry's Prison Run and Skibbity Toilets. And then you, you showed up with your hair and your eyes and you distracted my brother. So now I'm going to distract you. No, Sonny, please don't. It's too late. <laughs> when Melon gets back here, he's going to be so confused. I'll just hide right here. What the heck was that? Quandle had no idea about any kind of lottery. These scam callers nowadays. <laughs> Melanie? Melanie! No! What happened to her? What happened to her? There's a big axe here. Maybe. Maybe I can break her out. Maybe. This is what Sunny did to get me out, right? Come on. Melanie! Melanie! Oh! Melon! Melody, thank goodness you're okay. That was terrifying, Melon. Your friend and brother Sonny is a scumbag. He turned me into stone, and I think he's been the one pranking you. You're telling me it was Sonny the whole time? Sonny, you scumbag! I'll make you regret this. Wait, Sonny? You're the one who's the scumbag! You didn't play video games with me, all so you could hang out with your girlfriend. Bro, are you kidding me? So you turned her to stone? You're a dead man. You're a dead man! First, you'll have to catch me oh no ah! oh hold on a second guys i need to collect my watermelons they're ready for the harvest sunny yeah you suck <laughs> nah bro i rule time to harvest the melons okay grab my silk touch shears and oh yes they're beautiful they're so beautiful oh yes give me all the melons what is that why is there a muted zombie ah sunny help what is that noise Oh, no. He's summoning in zombies from the melon patch. Sonny, use your stone head or something. Melon, what is that racket? Hurry up, Sonny. There's a muted zombie outside. Oh, yeah, that low-key makes sense. I was wondering what all that noise was. I'm over here, you big, ugly zombie. And turn to stone. I got him. No way, bro. You're so strong. It actually worked. I know. I know I'm pretty awesome. Now, Melon. Whatever you do, don't break the stone statue. No, no, stop, 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 stop. Sonny, we gotta talk to Quandale. There could be more mutants on the loose. You're right. This looks like one of his experiments. What if they all broke out? All right, we gotta go check up on him. Um, Sonny? It looks like the mutants escaped. Ah! Yo, look at that jump. Bro, take him out. Take him out. I'm on it. And stone. Why'd he turn into a pig? Let's just not question this, Melon. Okay. Well, let's take out the others, bro. There's a mutant hoglin and there was one more. I don't know where the other one went. I'll handle this hoglin first. You think you got big muscles? Now you're stone. Yo, this one turned into a pig too. Well, at least it kind of makes sense now. Where'd this last mutant go? Wasn't it a mutant enderman? He could be anywhere. Um, Sonny, I can't see anything. I can't see anything. What's going on? The mutant enderman. He's here. Handle this and stone. I missed stone. I got him. Yo, you actually turned him into stone. I thought I was a dead melon. No problem, bro. I got your back. And watch out. There's a mutant Bob on the loose. Wait, no, that's just Bob. Sonny, chill. I got him. You just turned Bob to stone. Uh, I thought he was mutated. Oh. 
Sonny, don't tell anyone about this. Let's just let's just head home and pretend like we saved the village. Sonny, it's been a long day. It's time for me to get some sleep. You're telling me, bro. I'm the one who had to take out all those mutants. Oh. <sighs> He's already snoring. I didn't even have time to close the door. Bruh. How am I supposed to sleep? He's so loud and disgusting. <laughs> Wait a second. That gives me an idea. Why don't I turn myself into stone so I sleep soundly and then I'll jump scare Melon in the morning. Let's go. It worked. I just transformed myself into stone. The next day. Oh, good morning, Sonny. Um, Sonny? No! Sonny, you looked in the mirror, you fool! You turned yourself to stone! Help me. It's okay, Sonny. I'll get you out of there. Don't worry! Surprise! What the? Ah, what the heck? I can't turn myself into stone. I am the wielder of the Gorgon. Then what is this? And where'd you come from? I just recruited a villager, put him there, and then turned him to stone. What is wrong with you i can feel the power flowing through me melon that's what's right with me what's wrong though is i have a weak pathetic brother he doesn't even have a gorgon head wait what are you doing what are you doing now i kill the villager and make my way out of here it's time for me to take over minecraft i'm gonna be the next president of the world sonny sonny don't do it it's too late melon <laughs> <laughs> Chill! The president, he's over here with Quandale! I can smell him. And he smells good. President Crafton, it's an honor to see you here today, sir. Because you're about to pass on the presidency to me! <laughs> and now, I'm the president. Which, Quandale, that means you work for me now. No, Sonny, you fool. The only reason the president was here in my laboratory was to inform me that you have gone mad with power ever since you killed that Gorgon. Mad with power? <laughs> I don't think so. More like powerful with power. That's my point. That's exactly my point, Sonny. Then I'll show you what I mean, Quandale. Prepare to be turned into stone. You really thought I wouldn't have a force field to protect me from your Gorgon head? How do you have a force field? And more importantly, give me that. No, 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 this is my Gorgon head. I won't let you take it. No! And now let's see how you like being turned to stone. Oh, uh, Quandale? Quandale, don't do this. You don't have to do this. No! Yo, no way. Sonny, you just got turned to stone. That's what happens when someone has too much power. Oh, karma sucks, doesn't it, Sonny? <laughs> yeah, that is pretty funny. He's been kind of annoying recently. But you know what's not annoying? Pressing that like and subscribe button. Do it now.